officers say a man's home in Southern Door County was set on fire because he's a registered sex offender. No one was hurt in the Saturday morning fire and officials say they have charged two men in the case. Fox 11's Bill Miston has the details. 39-year-old Jason Johnson moved into this trailer about a month ago. Early Saturday morning, it caught fire. There wasn't an, an odor uh, of gas. Door County Sheriff Terry Vogel says investigators found a gas can nearby, and it didn't belong to Johnson or his brother, who lives across the street. We initially then did interview a uh, subject who also had the odor of gasoline on him. That was Mr. Hunt? It was, yes. 24-year-old T.J. Robert Hunt and 25-year-old Justin Baker, both of Gardner, were booked into the Door County Jail Sunday. So why did the two men allegedly set fire to the mobile home? Well, police say it's possibly because the man who lives there is a convicted sex offender. That was the motive behind it. When you heard that information? I was distraught. I was like, you gotta be kidding me. Somebody's trying to kill my brother. Jason Johnson was convicted in Michigan in 2009 of second degree criminal sexual assault, according to the state registry. His brother Dale says Jason has serious physical health and mobility problems. That's why he moved to live near his brother and sister-in-law. Fox 11 reached out to Hunt and Baker's public defender. He has not returned our calls. Vogel says Johnson has every right to live where he is. Even though, uh, you know, he may be a convicted felon on, on a kind of a sensitive type of a crime, uh, the citizens do not have the right to retaliate. Especially to this degree, Vogel says, taking the law into their own hands. In the town of Gardner, Bill Miston, Fox 11 News. Hunt and Baker have both been charged with arson and reckless endangerment. They're expected back in court next week.